Oh, oh my god. Anyway. Sh shush. Alright, what's up guys? Welcome to the three guys on Discord podcast um crew. Today we're gonna be doing our deck profile on Marincis. Uh this is a really epic based poggers deck uh that I played since it came out and was bad, but it's better now. So we're gonna we're gonna play the deck. Let's take a look at what we're playing. We're playing one Sleepy Maiden. Uh, we're only playing one because this card, uh, it's really only important for like weird setups where you can't get to Battle Ocean because your opponent like stopped it and you need to like send this to the grave and then banish it to like equip the Link for. Um, so that's why we're only playing one. We're playing three Blue Tang. It's insane. It Foolish Burials on Summon. We're playing two Pascalis. Uh, some people, I, a lot of people are playing two at this point. I don't know. I've gone back and forth between three and two. It's just, like, an extra guy, which is, like, fine. Uh, three Spring Girl. This card's insane. It just specials itself for free. It, like, lets you combo. Uh, we're playing the Water Tenyi. Realistically, there's, like, way better Water Extenders, but I wanted to play the Ultra Rare Shathanas I have in real life, so that's why I'm playing it. <laughs> we're playing uh, three Seahorse. Uh, card's crazy. It just specials itself. Uh, three Ash. One Mandarin. Some people are cutting this. Ah, I like it at one. Uh, three Droll, because it's really good in the format. Everyone's just playing Droll these days. Uh, two Effect Veiler, because I wanted to get down to 40 cards, so I cut an Effect Veiler. Two Desires, it just says draw two. It's great. Uh, three Cyanide Mining, three Dive. These cards are crazy for consistency. You got the one Called by the Grave, because uh, this deck can play through Hand Traps now, but, you know, Called by is still insane. Uh, two Battle Ocean, I'm playing two, because I play Desires, and, like, playing two makes it way less likely that you'll accidentally banish one. Uh, three Imperv, and two Wave. A lot of people play one. I play two because this card, I think, is good. So I want to draw it sometimes. Uh, we got the extra. We got Bahamut Shark. He's makes Toad. And this deck makes Toad way more consistent than it used to. Uh, Bubble Reef is, like, the secondary link for... Uh, you go into it when you, like, can't get to Battle Ocean sometimes. And, like, you also can't get the Sleepy Maiden. So you just want the card draw to try and draw Hand Traps. Uh, Aqua Argonaut's insane. It's a spell trap negate. It's crazy. Uh, access code for the follow-up turn. Trans code to help go into access code. Uh, Coral Triangle just like searches wave, which is cool. Uh, Coral and Enemies just like an extender, basically. It just summons anything back. Uh, Update Jammer is probably cope. In fact, I'm just going to cut it for Sea Angel right now, for like a second Sea Angel as I'm doing the deck profile, because... Uh, it's not very good. Uh, Splash Mage is crazy. On turn two, if you get to Splash Mage, you can just climb to access code, and then you win. Uh, two Crystal Heart, two Blue Slug, two Sea Angel. The usual stuff. Uh, on the side, we got Nibiru, Token Collector, Raigeki, Harpy's Feather Duster, Dark Ruler, Cosmic Cyclones, you know, just whatever. Uh, so that's the epic deck. And now we're gonna jump into some games with your boy, Triple C Gamer. Yo. Alright. Uh, uh, as soon as I am done with this deck, I, I'm down to the last three cards, sorry. <laughs> Alright, uh, I'll, I'm gonna name myself the Red Scizor, and then I'm gonna make a room in EU Central Competitive. Central Competitive, got it! And, uh, best of three, the password is gonna be subscribe, in lowercase. Alright, there we go. Alright, now we wait for Christian. Anyway, so how, how you how you boys been doing? Uh, uh, read any good books lately? Uh, you know. Nope. <laughs> uh, no. Uh, I read a menu again. Oh, that's, that's yeah. pretty good. That's pretty good. good. That's pretty good. Yeah. Um. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, we should announce our podcast is starting mm -hmm. at an undetermined date. Uh. Probably never, but you yeah. know. Uh, it, when it's out, it's out, and you, you'll, yeah, yeah, you'll, you'll get see it. it. You'll yeah, subscribe. Yeah. Please subscribe. Please subscribe to my Patreon that doesn't exist. Um, I need money, uh, to buy... Oh, uh, yeah, you guys want to plug anything else? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, subscribe uh... to my Twitch, twitch.tv slash five underscore points. Um, don't listen to that other five points on YouTube, that guy. Um, he makes Fire Emblem <laughs> videos, kind of cringe. Fire Man, Emblem? what did you say it was? Whoa, e you're, e you're, you're... central? You can't yeah. start beef Competitive. with that guy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I need to start some beef. That's, I need the drama. I need the views. There you are. <laughs> Uh, and I think I know what your password it's subscribe is. Subscribe in lowercase. Oh. <laughs> All right, here we go. So we're gonna play there best we of three. We're gonna show off how the deck works. Now, now the first thing you need to know about Marincess is you have to win the die roll, which we did. So that's a good start. Okay, so this hand's pretty good. Actually, this hand's really <laughs> good. Um, 
we're going to start with the sign at mining. We're going to pitch Sleepy Maiden because we really just want to uh, do it. And then we're going to grab... Um, yeah, yeah, let's just... grab... Oh, do we want... Yeah, let's grab Spring Girl. That seems all right. The nice thing about this deck is the combos aren't super strict. You can kind of freeform it and still end on the same board, so you don't really have to worry about like what order you summon things in, which is nice, because I don't like having to think. All right, uh, we link into Blue Slug. Uh, we chain block the Blue Slug effect with the Blue Tank effect, because that one matters less. Oh, a bunch of cards that we're already going to have access to. Well, you know, <laughs> that's fine. All right, let's special Seahorse, Link Seahorse into this. Now, unfortunately, I'm not sure how we're getting to Toad with this hand. Um, well, maybe we can. Maybe if we do it this way. Uh-oh. Oh! Ah! Okay, so this deck does lose to Nibiru. Uh... <laughs> It does, in fact, lose to Nibiru. Well, th oh, no. that's fine. We'll just set a couple of cards and pass. Uh, <laughs> uh, that's, that's, uh, that's very unfortunate. Unfortunato. <laughs> Bro, my man's main decking Nibiru. Oh, my gosh. Prosperity! Oh, no. Uh, you... Well, luckily you have at least a couple of points of interaction, but... Yeah, I mean, there's there's really nothing we could have done different. This deck just loses to Nibiru. That's just how it is. Whoa! Dragon Mate's crazy! Crazy! It's so crazy that I didn't get anything. <laughs> yeah. So... <laughs> you didn't get any I'll of say the starters. I'll take this. Holy frick. What did you add? Oh, the, the big one. There's a big one. Yo. Uh, hospitality. Special summon. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Just, oh my gosh. It's, it's, uh, the hand's looking kind of rough, huh? <laughs> that doesn't seem like the one you want to be special. Like, oh, okay. If you should sub these monsters for hand or field, what this card to your graveyard target? Uh, yeah, I just need two monsters on the field, bro. You could fuse with the Nibiru. To, oh my gosh! I wish I had one in hand. Uh, not division. I was like, what? That's crazy. No, not my token. Um, we're, we're still in this game, I think. Alright. Um, so in draw phase, I think we're gonna spend the Imperm to bait out the Shao and the Gate. Uh, draw phase, draw phase, draw phase, draw phase, draw phase, draw phase. Uh, I mean, I get rid of my negate either way. Yeah, this one's looking a bit sussy, a bit sussy. Oh, let's go. All right, so negated. And then I guess it just kind of depends on what that back row is. Well, we'll start with Spring Girl Banish, the other Spring Girl, I guess. And this is why I wanted to play two Sea Angel. Um, I'm glad I made that change, because it might come up. We're going to add back this one. All right, Spring Girl's effect. This one's kind of inconsequential, but... Oh, a cleanup. What does that one do? Target one monster you control, one card your opponent controls, or in their grave. Return them to the hand. Mm -hmm, okay. Well, luckily, we did not use our normal summon. Yeah. Um, that's the only thing. Uh, nice thing about the new Incest cards is that now with Sea Angel, we can search Dive, which is crazy. So we 
we, we might still have enough gas to do our combo. Reactivate Ocean. And then Dive lets us special from deck if we control Ocean, which is crazy. Mm. What do we want a special? Uh, sure, we'll grab Blue Tang. Blue Tang effect. And then we'll dump the Mandarin. Um, go into an enemy. Uh, this could get us something good, maybe. One, two, three. Oh, I mean, we'll take the wave. It's like, okay. Effect special. Oh, actually, yeah, this is crazy. We can special back the um, Sea Angel. And now because we have that zone, we can trigger Mandarin to special it to the Sea Angel. Uh, and this will let us get to the Link 4. Pretty good. We'll make Crystal Heart. And then we'll make Argonaut. Activate our effects. Um, let's add back Spring Girl for next turn. And then go equip, equip, equip. Um, just go to battle. Beat over the. Oh enemy. right, yeah, that's the uh, that's the that's the thing of this deck. Equip, 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 and you yep. gain more attack. Okay. Yep, and we're unaffected by your card effects. Sweet. As long as the field spell is up. All right, normal chamber. Well, I don't think I can let that resolve, so we gotta activate the wave. No. Uh, not chaining anything. Interesting. I can do that. Can I do that? Pissy. No, I can't do that. Lame. I thought I could do. Oh, because you're not pointing it. Okay, I see now. Yeah, you would need to move Pisty somehow. Wait. So tightening, banish, special summon. One dragon made from your hand or grave. Uh, what's in your grave? Can you look or? All right, I'm gonna call oh, by you... the nurse, I guess. That way you can't get its effect off this because you've already used chamber. Whoa, bow face. Gets the chamber back. There's a changeover. Uh, let's negate that. Crazy, a Marincis card that has a negate on it? Insane. You can you can negate that? Yeah, I know. The new Marincis cards are actually good. <laughs> this Wild. one's a spell trap negate. <laughs> oh. And then we can do this. Uh, banish. And then I think this should be game. Use these two to make transcode. Oh, you son of a! <laughs> transcode effect or five. Link into access code, access code effect, targeting trans code, activate effect, banish pop, battle phase. Whoa! Oh, that's right, you can do that. That's crazy. Yeah, just saved my life points because of that. <laughs> I saved the game. Um, I mean, I guess we just still attack. I guess I attacked in the wrong order, but I don't think it's going to matter. 
Right, that's a spell trap negate. Oh god. Um, let's see what happens if we normal this. Yeah, so I, I maybe I could have put enough damage. I just I just thought you were dead. I forgot that you could use that effect. Everyone always does. Well, that's fine. We'll just end on that. Uh, okay, I can do this. Uh, sure. It's unaffected by your card effects, but sure. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> okay. No one reads Marincess cards! So that's Sorry. the way con with Marincess is that nobody ever reads the Marincess cards. <laughs> I can't tell you how many times a Master Duel people will activate like three effects on my monster and be like, why isn't it working? Reading! <laughs> Reading! <laughs> yeah, yeah. Alright, game two. Alright, so siding in. Let's side, side in. This. Side decking. This. Probably not that. Let's cut one of this, one of this. So we're just going to cut these because they're not that important to the deck. Uh, we're probably going to cut this going second, and I'm just going to cut this going second. Because, eh, I don't know if I need the extra card draw going second. Wait, am I going first? Wait, what? Well, it's up to you. I'm just assuming you're going first. Oh, right, 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 <laughs> right, 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 right. I forgot. You could make I me am. go first. <laughs> Yeah, you're used to that master duel. You don't get the you don't get the two, two game two. I know, right? So uh, remember to subscribe to Triple C Gamer's YouTube channel. Uh, he uploads great videos. Like uh, I don't know when's the last time you uploaded. Uh, a Smash clip of me playing Hero, and I just got a crit on a Shulk who was in Smash. <laughs> classic, classic. That's a good one. Uh, subscribe to Triple C Gamer. <laughs> you better pick. You better uh, side in all your best cards. I'm certainly trying. Yeah. So now we're gonna see what happens with Marinsis, uh going second, which is uh, not very. It's not great. It's uh, you know. It could be worse. It's definitely gotten easier with the new cards because of how much better access you have to like extenders and stuff, but we'll see. Uh, this hand is pretty good. Oh, uh, this hand is pee pee poo poo. Uh oh, he's oh, just okay. saying the passive. Uh, well, what's up? It's your boy Pico. Speaking... Yo, it's me. I don't have anything to plug. Because okay. I don't exist online, apparently. Oh, he's, a, he's a phantom. <laughs> but but uh, apparently, there's a uh, there's a trying to date this episode. It's officially <laughs> one in the morning. True. Uh, and they're doing their forty million downloads for Master Duel, so they gave you a thousand gems. Oh, so all right, you guys, we're logging into that uh, right after Flunder... this. Because <laughs> I need nice. to uh, pull from some packs. So, yeah, Flender Adventure. Yeah, I'm gonna do it right now. I need to build a... I forget, wait, what did I need? <laughs> oh, I need Apex Avian, that's right. Yeah. Imperm, the monster who doesn't have an on-field effect. Was... See, like I said, guys, this is what this happens. Is... Your opponents never reads the Marincess Your cards. opponents never read, dude. <laughs> that didn't do anything. Your opponent never reads. Yeah, just... Just be thankful that your opponent never reads. And just be thankful that your opponent pulled two imperms. Oh Jesus no, Christ. not that imperming that card. Oh yeah. no, whatever shall I do? All right, anyway. Oh no. <laughs> See, this is the great thing. It's often people don't know where to hand trap where it says. And to be fair, it kind of changes depending on what my hand is. But so it's a little hard. But you know. Uh, so the insane thing is like, I already have dive. So now I can just go battle ocean. Um, activate dive. Special for deck, unless unless he has like ash. Oh, twin twister. That's kind of annoying. Uh oh. Yeah, see, the problem. Your opponent can side in the back row removal, but uh, uh, we can probably still make it work. Let's add. This. Oh, I should have special springer. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. 
Let's go. You know what? This is. Well, I if, literally... if, if we don't have field spell, it's probably better to make toad. So we're just gonna make toad. Um... Wait, what happened? Did you pop your other background? Wait, what happened? Yeah. Oh, you wanted that engraved. Okay. All right. Bahama shark effect. Summon the frog. It's the funny frog. He's here. Um. Yeah, I think that's fine. At least we end on a negate. And uh, the cards in our hand are pretty good, so. Hopefully, we should be able to survive until next turn. Yo, that was the worst poll I've ever had in my life. <laughs> I think I got <laughs> need six like SR, and that was it. <laughs> Yo, like, that's, what, that's what my polls were on that on the selection pack. I got like one UR, and it was like terrible or something. Holy crap, that was awful. At least I get a guaranteed the next 10 packs, but that's... Ugh, it's so far away. <laughs> I have seven gems to my name. Like I also kind of want to buy the uh, the skyscraper uh, field because it's super cool. Yeah, that's cool too. Whoa, spheres! Spheres pass. Spheres pass. Yeah, yeah. totally. Uh, it's never been done before. You have Ash, Unseen. of course you have Ash. God dang it. Yeah. Oh yeah, now it really is just Fierce Pass. Yo, let's go. All right. Let's activate Sign at my. Wait, what the heck? We don't need I'm that. going first. This is crazy. Hey, I just met you. <laughs> Remember when uh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon uh, Gates to Infinity referenced that? Good time. Did, did they? Yes. <laughs> Swan is like, made a Call Me Maybe reference. And it was like when that song was super popular. So it was definitely a reference. <laughs> I was like, why? <laughs> Thanks, localizers. All right. Uh, the great thing about Toad is that it's crazy. So we're going to negate that. Yeah, you negate the Yo. first effect. But you can't negate the second one. I don't care about the second one. Uh... Wait, Toad's broken. it. <laughs> Dang, it sure would be a shame if I had an imperm set. Alright, that's scoop. <laughs> yeah, I can make access come down. <laughs> Alright, well, guys, there you go. There you have it. That's New Marincess. It's actually playable. It's a good time. Remember Pain. to subscribe. Uh, 23 minutes! Alright, we're definitely getting the mineral ads. Uh, see you later, gamers! <laughs>